Hey, what's good, YouTube? Nathan Mass Collector back with another mail week video. It's been a couple weeks. Um, I think the last one I put out was September 8th, so everything that's came from came in from then on is what I got here. Um, not a ton of stuff, but more higher value things I've been picking up. Low numbered cards, uh, mainly Christian Wood again. Uh, I'm getting ready for, I cannot wait for the NBA season to start. Um, and I've been uh, trying to get rainbows in, you know, certain sets and things like that and getting close, but uh, there are still some out there that I don't have, but I'll show you guys what I've, what I've gotten so far. And then I also picked up some, some, some cool stuff here too. So um, first things, if you haven't uh, subscribed to my channel yet, please think about that. If you're digging the content, I would appreciate that. That would definitely help out the channel and um, like the video, leave a comment, and hit that bell for notifications. When I drop new videos, you'll be notified. So, I'm a Masters of the Universe fan. Uh, PowerCon was a couple weeks ago, which is a Masters of the Universe convention, and I saw some of these cards um, for sale on eBay, so I figured I'd, I'd pick some up. Um, but it's the American Retro Graphics Company. And the grand opening. So what I did was I bought these like hollow foil cards. And they're actually signed by the, the artist. And it's... Um, it's basically the cover from issue number two of the first Master of the Universe um, three-part series to open up their comic series. So I got these in. I'm like, wow, these are pretty. These are pretty rad. So there's only a hundred of them, and they're all signed and numbered on the back. So 83, 82, 49, 41. And I actually I liked them so much. The guy had five more or four more, so I bought those. And I think he's actually got more up there for sale, but I think I got enough now. <laughs> But, so I bought four of these, and then he sent all of these with for, for free. So here's the regular version. So, pretty cool. Pick those up. Um, this one here, I know it's it's probably just a reprint or something like that, but the reason why I bought this card it was because I, I have this poster, or I had this poster when I was a kid. I still have it, it's rolled up in a tube somewhere um, with, you know, poster putty probably all over the back of it still. But um, yeah, I had this poster when I was a kid, so when I saw that card, I'm like, you know, that's pretty cool. I'm gonna snag that one up. When I see those um, cards pop up, I'm, I'm picking them up the ones that I had posters of it's the same picture and things like that um I got on a break of optic recently Christian Wood so I got three of his base cards in that break um I picked up this foil I, I just bought this single hollow and then uh an elite on a 99 and then I got this stack here so this is all um i think they're all really nice condition but uh, i bought some boxes of extended series uh, hockey and i pulled a caprice off which was cool it was the rookie of the year this year dennis robin red really nice looking card um got a little bit of a ding there in the corner but it's out of 2.99 and then I got a bunch of select here, um, Christian Wood. So this is the purple and blue cracked ice, and this is the red and green cracked ice. And I believe there are only two versions of the cracked ice um, in, the, in the set. Uh, this is the blue retail prism silver, I guess you could call it. It's the only one I've seen for sale so far on eBay. Pick that up. Uh, this is a fast break. I got this out of a break that I was in. Here is a zebra 
it's not numbered. Here's an elephant print. Got a few of these now, I think. Um, I have four tie dyes. I think I got five total now. Uh, here is a orange pulsar. So this is first out of first of first of the line, off the line release. This one's uh, five out of fifteen. Here's a gold prism. Uh, this is number nine out of ten. Here is a purple pulsar. This again, this is off of uh, the first off the line boxes. And this one's out of five. So this is number four out of five. And then I got this one. Uh, it's a flash black and yellow. This is one on one. So there's one one on one. And then I got the snake skin first off the line pulsar snake, snake skin one on one. Um, I picked up this red, or I'm sorry, green certified, and uh, this is number one out of five. So getting this one completes my rainbow for this certified set. Um, I have the 101, this was the other one I was looking for, so I got all of those now. I'll send them all off to get graded at the same time, probably somewhere. Um, out of 199, this is the hoops, hollow foil, uh, a gold pulsar hoops premium. Um, generally these, these are numbered out of like 10 or eight or something like that, but it's not numbered, but generally gold is around that 10 area. I don't know if that's true for these or not, but, uh, blue velocity. numbered out of 99 got a couple silver prisms uh, I got a blue team all right here so it's like the blue wave not numbered uh, we got a couple red out of 299 Add to the mini that I already have. Here is a purple cracked ice, which is number one seven out of one seventy five. Here's a red fast break, numbered out of one twenty five. Here is a purple prism out of one, out of ninety nine. really cool uh, purple fast break out of 75 here's a pink pulsar the, the outlines off a little bit but centering and everything looks pretty good uh, this is numbered out of 42 Green Pulsar, this is numbered out of 25. Neon Green Fast Break, which is number to five, this is number four out of five. And I got three of these uh, Spectra Celestials, Celestial. <clears throat> These are out of 99. 
but super cool looking cards. I love these things. Spectra is underrated in my opinion. I think they look great. Um, here is a cracked ice version of the Spectra, which is numbered out of 35. And then I got this marble one, which is numbered one out of five. Super, super cool looking. This marble effect back here, it's really neat. And then for graded cards, I got four. Um, this one here, I got really cheap. Uh, it's an orange on a 99 SGC9. I think I got it for $12. 15 total, I think, with shipping. Um, I got the Rookies uh, Mint 9. Like, super cheap, too. I got this one for, like, 25 bucks. And I got this one for, like, 30 It's a Mint 9. Ready to Rookie off-centered. I think that's the only thing that held this one back. Looks pretty damn good. Everywhere else. And then the last one I got is a black cracked ice one of one. Gem Mint 10. So picking this one up helped me get closer to my rainbow on the uh, Hoops Premium stock. I think I need six more and that's it. For the, all 45 of those, or 47, or whatever the hell it is. So, yeah, really cool that I picked up some of these uh, really, you know, the one on ones that I've been looking for. Um, super, super cool. I picked those up. So three one on ones in this, in this mail day. It's pretty neat. So. Um, thanks guys for checking out the video. I really appreciate it. Um, again, if you haven't subscribed yet, please, please think about that. Uh, I haven't been doing many videos lately. We're getting ready to go to Disney World on a family vacation in a couple weeks. So I'll probably be offline for most of, um, you know, the middle of October for sure. So I'll try to get some more videos out if I have anything that I need to edit, get those done with. But um, yeah, excited about the Disney vacation and terrified at the same time. Uh, mainly just, I'm just waiting for something to go wrong. <laughs> but I hate thinking like that, but that's just me worrying about everything when it comes to COVID and bullshit like that. But um, it's not bullshit, but just the, you know, mandates and shutdowns and flights and things like that. So I'm praying that everything goes well. I'm sure it will, but I'm just, uh, we've canceled this thing twice, going dating back to the May 2020 so hopefully it goes off without a hitch this time but I um, uh, appreciate you guys again thanks a lot um, again subscribe if you haven't like the video leave a comment let me know what you guys think and then hit that bell for notifications and you'll be notified on the next one I drop and uh, we'll see you on the next one later